what's up you guys <laughs> we're like exit exit right now out of this video immediately now that i'm calm down what's up how are we doing welcome back to my channel thank you guys for being here if you are new here my name is allison make sure you subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on any of my videos today's video i am basically showing you some lingerie i bought from ivy rose i'm gonna try it on for you and we're gonna see how it turns out not too long ago actually it was quite a bit ago it was at least five months ago i did do an ivy rose try on haul yeah that's that's what i did and, you know it's like 50 50 as far as like what we liked how things turned out and here i am again purchasing some lingerie and we're just gonna see how it turns out if you are interested in seeing my did i already say that i did that I don't know because I'm so all over the place but if you do want to see my other try on haul of Ivy Rose then I will leave it linked down below make sure you check that out we had some hits and misses for sure and I'm sure that's how it's gonna go down in this video because that's just how Ivy Rose is if you don't know what Ivy Rose is I'm not gonna say that it's an online boutique or an online store because in my last video I said that and somebody commented and they were quite offended um, that I said that and they're like their distribution center in China and then started going off about some stuff and I was like whoa okay like I don't know I follow Ivy Rose on Instagram I purchased from them before they're just like another Fashion Nova if anything I feel like Ivy Rose getting their stuff from Fashion Nova and then selling it i don't really know i don't even know why i bought this lingerie actually i do know because i need more lingerie <laughs> it's affordable prices so all of my items range from about 15 to 25 dollars. so i think i got like five different items if you can't tell i am really into neon this is the bottom very cute so here is the top and it's super cute as well this whole set right here i honestly bought because this looks like a crop top not a bra and i'm going to wear it as a crop top probably in vegas next week when i go to vegas so it better fit and look good another set i got that is pretty much just like that one um except it's like neon yellow with like a baby pink is that the front or is that the back okay yeah so the back is like nylon <laughs> maybe and the front is like the lace so the front is maybe a little bit see-through the bottoms are very similar to that first one but the top is is very different this is definitely going to be see-through i'm probably gonna have to put some pasties on if i try this on for you guys because you know uh youtube will not be happy and i'm not showing the nips for free <laughs> okay this piece honestly when i opened it i was like oh, i don't recall that really looking how I wanted it to. Here's the bottom. Just a little, you know, nothing spectacular. I feel like the stitching on this is pretty freaking bad. I can already tell you right now, this is not going to fit. It looks really big. And that's the thing about like ordering from Ivy Rose, Sheen, Amazon when you're ordering lingerie is sometimes like you get a small on a bra and panty set and either like the top is too big and the bottoms are small or the top is too small and the bottoms are too big. You know what I'm saying? These don't even look like a small. I ordered a small. These look are looking a little medium and this, um, I don't even, I don't even think it really looked like this on the on the website this does not look like it's going to look good or fit at all i have two more so here's like a one piece type set that's like crochet ish the back is like all very strappy this is gonna take a hot minute to figure out is this an open front no it's not <laughs> i think it's super cute i'm really hoping that this is gonna look good on um, but yeah, it's like super like crochet knitting 
type fabric. You guys, I love bling, so that's why we order stuff with lots of bling. Um, looks the right size. And then this, what does this do? I'm gonna have to pull up the pictures to remember how things go. Oh, okay, so I think this is the little garter belt thingy. And then the bottoms, um, yeah, just a bunch of strings again. <laughs> So yeah, I'll have to figure it out as I put it on. But you you get the idea. All the little rhinestone deals are going to be in the back. And you guys probably aren't really going to be able to get to see that. But those are the sets that I got. I'm going to go ahead and start trying them on so you guys can see. Okay, so here is one set. I really like it. I still can adjust the straps a little bit just to push these small little girls up a little bit it's just like a really cute little bottom not showing too much could literally pull this off as like a little bathing suit this summer with some waterproof pasties i do have pasties on so you can't be seeing like all the goodies okay but i really like it i like the fit fits good this was a great great purchase Okay, so I'm literally, because you can't be seeing like all this, this is probably the worst lingerie set I have ever purchased. This is not what I thought I was buying. These are the worst bottoms I have ever, ever put on in my life. So that's all I have to say about this. This is really gross. And that's all we're gonna show you of it. Here we have the little crochet pink one piece type deal and it's super cute. It has these little chain details on both sides. You have to remember to actually put them, you have to put your feet through them like a skirt. So I'm not turning all the way around but it is nothing but a g-string. These all connect all the way in the back. Um, that's all you get to see of that. And then of course we have these, so probably, you know, put some thigh highs on, baby pink or something like that. I really like this little ensemble we got going on here. Super sexy. We have two that we like so far. So we're doing we're doing pretty damn good. Here we have the silver sparkly. The top is literally, I feel like an extra small, not a small. I do, however, I like it. It's still going to work. Um, can't show you more than that for the back, but these things go all the way around. Oh, they were all stuck. Are they stuck? I like how the bottoms fit. The bottoms fit fine. Um, this piece right here, so you literally have to pull it up over your hips. Now, it's fine for the elastic piece, but the little rhinestone chains that we have going on here, if I had bigger hips, there's no way I was going to be able to get this little belt thingy on. I do like it. It is going to work for what I need it for. We're gonna change into the last little outfit and we'll be right back. I love this one. I love this top. It's a top. It's not a bra. It ain't a bralette. Okay, it's a bralette. Um, so this is just like the pink and yellow one as far as the bottoms go. It's very, very comfortable. Really quickly, I do just want to mention that the silver piece really started itching when I turn off the camera to start taking it off. It really started itching. So there's absolutely no way I could ever wear that and like feel comfortable and wear it for a long period of time. So we're probably going to wear it for a photo shoot. <laughs> Done deal. This is going to have multiple uses. 100%. I love this top, but everything else worked out besides that ugly red and black thing that I bought. If I was to compare this little haul to my clothing haul, the lingerie is doing way better than Ivy Rose clothing. So that's just what I feel about that. I feel like they were good purchases. I got them in a timely manner as far as shipping. Actually, I think I paid extra to get them 
quickly, so never mind on that. Yeah, if you were thinking about purchasing some lingerie from Ivy Rose, don't buy from Ivy Rose. I don't even know why I bought from Ivy Rose. Just go onto Amazon or go to Sheen. Actually, can I take it back? Can I take it back? Because Sheen and Ivy Rose are literally the same because I'm really thinking about doing another video talking about like purchasing cheap lingerie pretty much from Amazon and Sheen. So if you guys want to see something like that, let me know down in the comments below. I think that's about it for this video. If you guys like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below. And if you're not subscribed already, please make sure you subscribe to my channel. I would really appreciate the support. If you're not following me on my other social medias, I will leave everything linked down below. Go follow my Instagram. I do all kinds of outfit pictures all the time. That's all my Instagram is really. If you want to see some more lingerie content, uh, you're going to have to subscribe to my OnlyFans. <laughs> Shameless plug. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.